this is a tired Christine Chandler coming to you live from home once again with announcements. I have been made aware that the recent video logs for reading Rainbows, Unicorns, and the Bluebird Happiness, happiness are not very popular. Well, you can definitely blame that on Mr. Bill. Because he was the one that suggested I do it. And frankly, I find it nonsensical myself between chapter after finishing chapter three and beginning chapter four. There's Kevin again. He, he became dead. What the hell? <sighs> anyway, and then I real and then I have been made aware that y'all would like maybe something original, and in the lines of like a day in my life. But guess what? I tell you what, my days. I've been short lately, and I know that every in my subconscious there's a new thing that's gonna press that's gonna press on my anxiety and stress levels and just totally drain me all over again. Where I'm not gonna feel like doing anything. <sighs> it just drives me bonkers. <sighs> and then the finances. There's this always with the finances here, the mortgage, the bills, everything. I know you don't want to hear this shit because y'all have this, y'all have these problems yourselves in your own way, but you know what? And over, I'm in over my head. And I drew much, and I pretty much thinned myself out by doing the shop in the first place, and then what happened with Lulu.com last December, that was resolved, but that I really want it downhill for me. And I really do want Sonic and Rose Shoe to be franchise to go and whatnot. Officially with Sega and maybe Nintendo, but really with Sega. Get the console games going where I do the store I'd help out with the stories and everything. It's a cartoon show where I actually take full directions and Make the stories and whatnot, and maybe I do a script for the comp for comic books, and let somebody else do the drawing. I don't know. It's all over my head. A lot of, this, of these details are in over my head. That's why I got my friend. That's why I ended up making my lady friends, who pretty much becoming my managers, which I appreciate that very much. Yes, I do. Thank you both. Anyway, I just. I don't hear anything from Sega officially, and I really would prefer actually to get the, get in the mailbox physically at home. I don't check my emails that often, even though my even though my friend even though my lay friends do. And sometimes they have to tr thin out the trolls and whatnot. Uh, but I'll tell you what, official Sega representative, fly on over. Proof, him or herself, to me, and then we could actually get talking right here in Ruckersville. But no. And Sachu is actually, I believe, to be, actually, could be the next big thing for Sega. Guess she helped pull Sonic out of the ground with all the darn fan fiction directions. Should have kept it original, Sega. Stick to the originals. Plots and whatnot, not change a darn thing, including the arm color change, which I'm glad that that got finally resolved with the new Mario and Sonic Olympic game. And then on. <sighs> anyway, I just I have so much of my mind at home. I gotta take care of my family, my mom, my dogs, my cats. And I gotta do this and that. It's a grind around here, especially in my noggin. <sighs> I don't know. Anyway, that's... But I am going to have something. I'm going to tell a, sto a Sanchi story, a new one, or reprise it from old and make it and becoming new. I have it all... I have something written out for when I do my thing over at OmegaCon later this summer. And I believe that's in here. That's over here in Shotsville. Hey, that's a whole nother story right there, but anyway, uh, finances, mortgage payments, uh, we really could use some more money around here because as quickly as it comes in, it goes out. Because we gotta pay bills and we gotta get food around here, we gotta keep ourselves fed and everything. So please help us. 
I really do want to deliver new Sanchi and Roshu content, but I, it's hard for me to get back to the pages and drawing with all this stress in my life. And I really would like to be able... I have actually made little to no progress on the orders from Etsy store. I mean, I am, that, I am working on, I'm working on getting myself motivated to do all that. And if I had the money, I'd, re, I'd reimburse everybody, but I don't have a thousand dollars or so. It's all, it's all got to go out to the food, the bills, everything, and it's driving me crazy. <sighs> Help. Please help. Help keep me and my mother fed. 74 years old she is. Two dogs. Two cats. Got a family of kittens in the backyard. And I'm still looking for a sweet for my sweetheart. You think I'm famous enough to actually be able to get women? I have not been so fortunate. And yes, I've only had sex two times, ever, in my lifetime, so I'm not a virgin. And they were both in the same month, and that was more than, that was more than four years ago. <sighs> <sighs> you think your life sucks because you're dwelling in your mother's basement, you darn dirty internet trolls and cyber bullies. Think of how it is in my head. We need help. Uh, uh, I don't know. Anyway, that's about it for right now. Just around here, ear, mission hide, directly donate to me to my mom. I wish Cole Smithy would help us, but he's in New York being greedy, throwing his money away into the fire when he could be sharing it with his own mother to help pay him back, to help pay her back for the, putting him to the schools, the college, and the brand new car. I was new in about 1980 or so. <sighs> and Alan and Carol could help me out because I'm still their half sibling. And with the, with our late father being in the memory, he comes visit me in my dreams nearly every night. Day, I don't know. I'm on a night schedule right now, and I'm trying to get back on a day schedule. It's difficult. My subconscious doesn't want to get me out of bed because I know something is going to make me crazy that day. Every day, something crazy. <sighs> I get drained. <sighs> oh well. <sighs> That's it. Have a good day.